Hi, I'm Maddie Overturf. And I'm Matt Pensick with our weekly check-in on WRDE as we prepare to launch Coast TV News later this year. While most of these updates are geared towards the future, this week we'll take a step into the past and give you a history lesson on WRDE. WRDE signed on the air in May 2004 as W59DZ and in 2005 officially became licensed as WRDE. For 10 years, WRDE aired programming from a number of outlets, most notably my TV and Cozy TV. That was until the spring of 2014 when General Manager Bob Backman finalized a deal making WRDE an NBC affiliate, the first major network affiliate to be based in Delaware. It seemed to me that the people here were very special. And eventually I found out there was no NBC station, and I believe the people in Delmarva deserved their very own NBC station. So when we finally got it, it was a dream come true. In the fall of 2018, Draper Holdings announced its purchase of WRDE, and that sale became official New Year's Day 2019. We've expanded the places you can get it free with an antenna. We've launched Coast TV on Verizon Fios, and we're providing a high-definition signal to Dish subscribers. And now on to the next chapter of WRDE, the first-ever local newscast in the first state. Still some work to be done, but with each passing week, it puts us one day closer to the time that we can bring you Coast TV News. Coverage you can count on coming this fall on WRDE Coast TV.